Hi, this is Eva. Thank you for joining me. I'm 100% raw. I have been 100% raw for the last three years. Prior to that, I was high raw for two. I am currently traveling with my family in an RV over uh, all over the US. So what I eat in a day greatly depends on where I'm at, what season it is, what food I can find, what's local, what's organic, what's fresh. The way I eat has also changed greatly over time. When I first started this lifestyle, I was very, very dogmatic. Now I'm a lot more relaxed. I know that if I don't eat great one day, I will the next day, even though I eat 100% raw. I don't always eat great. Sometimes I eat way too much or way too little or way too much of one thing. It's okay. The next day I'll just, I'll just make better choices. The raw food lifestyle though, um, it's like an onion that you peel very, very slowly. The first part of the journey is always the physical part, that's where you feel the most. Physically, obviously, you have to give your body time to adjust to everything, so it takes a while. And then you get to a mental uh, state where your mental clarity changes, shifts, and then you get to a spiritual state where you actually realize that things that you had pushed down are no longer going to stay down, everything's going to come up to the surface. I think this is the best stage to be in. Um, it, it can be painful, but you know, with raw food, you can't stuff yourself, you can't numb yourself, you can't stuff your feeling. Of course, I'm not perfect, and I don't always do perfectly. The important thing is to be consistent, as with anything, it's just the consistency that will get you there. So, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Have a blessed day. Thank you. For this watermelon but it's not very good so I think I'll just have a couple bananas instead